happening at Windsor, California. It's been a, a four-year project in the making, and we're finally to the moment where we're inviting guests to come in and, and help us um, get this place up and running. So it's a soft opening tonight and tomorrow night. We want to work out the bugs and the kinks before we open officially to the rest of the public on Thursday. So we're super excited. So right now, our focus is just getting our equipment running, the new equipment running well. So about half the beers will be from Windsor, half the beers will be uh, from uh, Santa Rosa, from 4th Street, and you know, like I said, all right, all we're trying to do is just get the equipment running well. Um, we have 15 or 20 new pieces of equipment and new operations in the brewery, and everything is starting from scratch. Over time, we'll end up with a lot of new Belgian beers. Um, a, a lot of new everything and honing in our brewing skills with the equipment here. Um, it's, a, it's an amazing brew house that makes amazing beers and we're just excited to, uh, to be just working out the kinks and eventually offer a lot of great beers. A lot of beers for the new open top fermenters that gives us a lot of unique flavor uh, changes and differences compared to a closed top tank that we're used to uh, working with now. Uh, some new styles, uh, a whole separate funky brewery, meaning so a lot of new sour beers and barrel aged beers uh, using different fruits and different techniques. Uh, not only open top fermenters in the non-funky clean brewery, but also some open tops in our funky brewery and the cool ship to make spontaneous fermented beer also.